Hello, the ladies and gentlemen, it's Noah. And welcome to another installment of your favorite series ever, Football Shirts. I got in, insert month here and year, I suppose. But um, this is January of 2022, recording this in June of 2022. Will I ever get caught up? Leave down in the comments if you think I will or not by the end of 2022. For those who don't know what this series consists of, it just consists of me going over shirts that I got in said month, you know, the one in the title. Obviously, not all the shirts that I get are included in these. Some of them get a one-off on their own. A lot of the shirts will be in this series, though, that I do get. It'll be the majority, at least that's how it stands right now. But certain special editions, such as the Aguero shirt, it wasn't included. It got a special edition video on its own because it's relevant to the time and just because I want to give it a video on its own. Just because the shirt's in here doesn't mean I value it any more or any less than any other shirt I have. I might, honestly, but this shirt right here is very high on my list, but there's gonna be shirts that I value less that get a video on their own. So that's just that. Starting off with the first of nine shirts in this video, we have the Bayern Munich 1993 to 95 home shirt. We have a lovely embossed crest right here. You know, we have the stitched stripes going down the shoulder, Stripes down here, of course, it's all stitched, and it's just beautiful. This shirt is the player version. We do have the lovely flocking on the back for Matthias, number 10, but what a beautiful shirt this is. And honestly, probably, I shouldn't say this. It's my favorite shirt in this video, to be honest. It only goes downhill from here, but no, there's definitely shirts in here, not for everyone, because not everyone's gonna like these shirts. Stupid saying, saying, oh, there's something here for everyone. There's not, okay? It, it's not. It, there might be, but I highly doubt it. Because there's gonna be some people watching this be like, I don't like a single one of these shirts. So, screw you. I'm just kidding now. Maybe, maybe. Maybe screw you, I don't know. Um, do you even like shirts? Because I mean, there is a decent variety here. I suppose not too much of a variety. But, um, yeah, are you American or do you like MLS shirts? Cause boy, do I got some for you. Plenty of them actually, but, um, I'm going to pull up this on my phone. I'm going to read off my phone. Wow. Very unprofessional. I know this shirt right here, LAFC away shirt, 2019. It's the authentic Jersey. Okay. $9. Off of the MLS in the season sale. That's what most of these shirts are here for because they were bought for so cheap. But what a beauty it is. I really like this shirt. It isn't a large, you know, but it's authentic. So maybe, yeah, I can fit in it. It'll be a little bit bigger than I like, but not too shabby of an LAFC shirt. Not their favorite, not their favorites. Maybe it is their favorites, I don't know. But not their best, in my opinion. But I do love the YouTube sponsor. It's pretty dope, YouTube TV. But the shoulder to shoulder, they're right there by the back of the neck. Nothing on the back, but $9, not a bad pull. Okay, so let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Not many cuts in this, I know. And I'm opening this out of the bag. But this is the Atlanta United 2020 home shirt. It's just the replica. Also purchased for nine dollars. Another nine dollar shirt. Nice shirt, you know. Atlanta United. Not a fan of United. Any Uniteds really, for that matter. I like that there on the back. But for nine dollars, believe that's a heck of a steal. This nose has a star also, and. He says number 18 in it for the year 2018. You know what? Pretty dope. This isn't a size small. It'll fit me. You want it more so tighter fits, but it will fit me. Nice. So moving on to the next shirts. Which one am I grabbing? It is the replica for 2020 slash 21. These are all 2020 slash, no, this one isn't. Wait a minute. Yeah, this is the 2019 shirt right here. Ignore what I said about the 2020 slash 21. This is the 2019 
slash 2020 OA shirt. Clean look. I like it, honestly. There's not much to it. I do like the subtle stripes there. Straights. So that kind of weird. Stripes there on the front. They're not on the back at all. Nothing on the back. Nothing on the collar. Nothing that I see. 32805. Cool. Zip code, Orlando. Pretty clean shirt, simple, but I think it does the job, you know. A lot of times Adidas lets down on the last teams. I mean, they've gotten a lot better though, let's be honest. They've been doing pretty solid. I will say this doesn't include a Nashville SC shirt. We have a little flag there. Geo's part opening match, May 1st, 2022. Went to that game, you know, big ups Nashville SC 1-1. It sucks that it was a draw, but that's what we do best is draw for the most part. So there's that. But no national shirts in this. Also, I want to point out Cincy shirts were also on sale. Didn't buy any Cincy shirts. Could have bought an FC Cincinnati shirt, but I didn't. This neck shirt, though, which one is this? Oh, this is the better one, I think. We have a 2020 slash 21 Houston Dynamo alternate jersey. Oh, I like this shirt. I like it a lot. I like that there's no sponsor right there. If there is a sponsor, I'm, I mean, I know there's a sponsor on the original version, but I'll show a picture of that now. But Houston Dynamo, I just think it's so clean. Alternate shirt, nothing on the back. But I just love that design. It's so simple, but clean. Very clean. Lovely. Let's go ahead and move on to another Houston Dynamo shirt. This one being the 2020 slash 21 alternate jersey. Do they have more than one? Fact check me on that. That's just what this MLS store says. That Houston Dynamo shirt was a size small. I missed out something. We have the Texas flag there on the corner of it. Wow. We also have it on this one. But there this one is. It's all right. All right, great. MD Anderson Cancer Center. Kind of cool that they cross out the cancer. Unfortunately, that didn't cure it. It's still around. But if we just cross it out, pretend it's not there. You know, whatever. Not a great shirt, this one. 1320 is what I bought this one for. I forgot that I was mentioning what I bought these shirts for. This video scuffed. $12 on this one. Okay. The Orlando one. Did I say how much it was? I don't think so. $12.60. So more than $9 on those, but that's fine. Still a heck of a deal in my opinion. Let's go back to LA with a home replica jersey. Size small. The cheapest one, too. Six dollars. Got the nice lining there. Like, nice little pattern. See it better in the close ups. And the last patch, of course. Shoulder to shoulder, once again. Six dollar jersey. Not bad. Size small. But I can fit in it. Will I wear it much? Probably not. Do I wear most of my jerseys? No. Do I wear hardly any? Yeah, I do. Now the my favorite probably of these shirts. You know, less wise, we have 2021 Prime Blue LASC shirt. Voila. So this one. $19.50. Size medium, though. It looks massive. Maybe it's gonna hold up smaller shirts, though. But this is just a replica. I said $19.50. $20 shirt, pretty much. I'm not gonna complain about it. I love this pattern. I say this pattern, it's a template. I don't. I'm more so obsessed with this color. I like that color blue. I think it looks clean. Looks very, very nice. Lovely shirt. This next shirt I won from a raffle. Regarded as the Anfield 
89 shirt. We have a lovely Arsenal shirt. Beautiful. Come on, you gooners. Yellow. You know, I love the can in there. That logo. Beautiful. The old Adidas sponsor, Adidas. Nice shirt. I like the pattern, you know, the cannons along. You see that better in the close up, of course, because you're looking at that right now. Nothing on the bag, no flocking or anything. Older shirt, though, you know. Beautiful, though. Beautiful, beautiful Arsenal shirt. Delighted to have gotten it in a raffle. This next shirt is also a raffle win. I showed it Arsenal shirt before. Tottenham fans, sorry. If you're still here, thank you, because you'll definitely want to see this one. So I think it's a lot better than that nasty Arsenal one we just showed. I don't think it's nasty, to be fair, but this one I, I like a lot better, I will say. We have the 1999-2001 Arsenal away shirt. Lovely Sega sponsor there on the center. That's what I love. That That's great. Great sponsor. Bring stuff back like this, you know? Sega, Sega. Beautiful. Best part about this, not the best part, but a great part. Thierry Henry, my first Henry jersey, too. So that flocking is there. I mean, it's not peeling away either. It's on there pretty good. That's one thing I was worried about. But that nice velvet flocking there on the back. We do have the FA Premier League patches on the sleeves. That old Arsenal crest, the Sega. It's a little bit hard around the edges, but it's not really peeling off. Beautiful shirt. Now, let's get more so to modern day. Back to it. Because I don't feel like I pull off retro shirts. I don't feel like I look too great in this. Honestly, I don't think I look bad. I look pretty freaking good. Maybe. Do I? Leave in the comments down below. Am I handsome? Do I look handsome in this shirt? Do I? Does this turn you on? Does it? Oh, you're still here. Well, it didn't turn you off because you would have left. So, I appreciate it. But if you're gone, you, you humbled me. Nope, still got the view though, it's fine. How many views this video got? Oh, not very much. But you were here, thanks for watching. <laughs> we got one more shirt to show. I'm still talking, I'm just gonna ramble on. It's fine. Cause this next one, we're, we're in and off on a, a pretty good bang, I'd say. I don't think it's a bad one to end off on by any means. For the final shirt of the video, we have the 2021 slash 22 limited edition Palermo shirt. I love this. I love this shirt so much. I was honestly worried I wasn't gonna be able to get it. A thousand were produced. You can see that there on the bottom. It has a little license plate. That's what they're called, right? But we have number 182 out of a thousand. Also, all the design, like that design, I say all the designs. I suppose they are all the designs because they are all the crest in Palermo's history in that semi-transparent background, some may call it. We have the lovely pink, black, and gold lining around the collar. That Palermo crest, that new one, I still think is sick. A lot of people prefer the old one. But the cool thing about this, numbered out of a thousand, they played against Bari, what date was it? December 19th. 2021 in this shirt. I'll show on the screen right there. That's what those shirts look like that were issued to the actual players. So there are a thousand of these made, but those are also numbered. That includes, like, those are included with the thousand, which is sick, you know? It's not like there's a thousand and, you know, 20 something, you know, or a thousand and eleven, obviously it'd be more than eleven, but it's actually a thousand total. And in that game, it finished 0-0 with a red card in the 41st minute, Terranova, a Bahari player. So it's seen the, this shirt, not this one that I'm holding, but this design shirt, you know, this manufactured shirt, was seen once in a match that ended 0-0. So that's pretty cool. But I did get this brand new with tags, of course. Bought this from an Italian hype beast store. 
ended up having to buy something else because I had to reach a certain price or it wouldn't even let me buy it. So I bought like some random like Hulk Sportif shirt, you know, just to raise the value up because everything on there was stupid expensive and I didn't want to buy hype beast clothes because I'm like, I'll just buy jerseys at that point. I'm going to spend $500 on a shirt. It's probably going to be a jersey for the most part. So that's my tortoise. He's scratching on the on the box. You wanna see him? No, I'll show him. Here he is. Ain't he handsome? God, I love that light. But isn't he a beautiful boy? His name's Ottoman. Check out his Instagram and his TikTok. I love you, Otto. And I also love you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for watching. I'm SNL. This is Otto. And adios.